Here's how to export your iPhone contacts. Now, if you're on your iPhone, just open up the contacts app here. So I have the contacts app and you can see all of my contacts on here. Now, if you just want to export one or two different contacts, the easiest way to do that is just to tap on the contact and then just hit share contact. And now we'll hit done. It'll pop up with an option that says share your contact card. You can share it through AirDrop. You can also tap on email if you wanted to email it. And you have a bunch of different other options as well. You can upload it to Google Drive, save it to your iCloud or your files, all of those things. So essentially you can share it that way. However, let's say you wanted to share all of your contacts and export them all. For to do that, basically we're going to tap on the list option at the top left. And now you're going to go up to where it says all contacts. Of course, if there's just one group or one account that you want to export, you can do that. But in this case, all contacts, I will tap and hold on it and hit export. From here, I'm going to hit the select all fields at the very bottom and then hit done. From here, it will show you a similar screen. Essentially, it allows you to airdrop it, you can save it to files, you can text it, you can email it. Even if you have a USB plugged into your iPhone, you can transfer it to the USB by just hitting save to files and then going back, back and navigating to that USB in here. But let's say I wanted to email it. So tap on the email button here and you can see it pops up with all contacts.vcf. So it has all of my contacts combined into a VCF file. Just make sure you open up that VCF file after you've emailed it or sent it to that other device, wherever you wanted to move them. And then update, basically open up and update all of those contacts by just extracting it or clicking on that VCF file and it will bring in all of those new contacts.